Alright. Should I turn my light off? For some reason I was like, oh my gosh, why is Until Dawn on my screen? But that's not Until Dawn. It's The Last of Us Fart Poo. I'm kidding, I like this game. It's not Fart Poo. I'll turn it up a bit more. What were you dreaming about? Are you talking? Sure, you don't want to do this when the sun's out? Mm -hmm. Warmer? No. Can't wait. And you don't want to just tell me? You need to see it. This conversation is utterly fascinating on second playthroughs of the game. Been restless. This whole scene. You too. It makes so much more sense on a like repeat playthrough. You want to keep going? Just drive all the way to Mexico? I thought about it. You can see Manny's hometown. <laughs> yeah, I don't see that living up to his stories somehow. <laughs> no, probably not. <laughs> you did all this in the dark? Yes. Now, come on. If you keep going like this, we're going to be tired for today's trip. Not that far. Yeah, is Mel okay? She seemed out of it these past few days. She'll be fine. You stop being weird, you're freaking me out. I'm not being weird. Are you breaking up with Mel? What? No. <laughs> you wish. Uh, I've had my fill. Thank you. <laughs> Ouch. We can't all be as graceful as you. Really? What is that? You'll be fine. It's too high. Come on. Hey, eyes on me. Abby, stop looking down. Okay, maybe I'm not talking enough. Because oh, I was like, I'm not going to talk during cutscenes, but this, this isn't way? even a cutscene. Consider it an opportunity to work on your fears. How about I work my foot up your ass? Abby, stop flirting. <laughs> Oh, is he going to help me up, or do I just have to wait? I could get up there on my own, what the heck? Okay. 
assuming he's in there, how do we get to him? We can corner one of the trolls and get confirmation, and then, I don't know, maybe find a way to lure him out. Yeah, okay. I'm sure they'll be happy to offer that information. Well, then we make them. Do you hear yourself? That might sound better. Mean? Better. I said batter. I meant to say better. What is going on? But I mixed up the vowels. That was pregnant. Oh, shit. That's why I have the subtitles so big, so you guys can see them. Okay. It's not just that, though. Should I say congrats? Everyone else sees this. They're going to want to turn back. We can convince them, right? I knew I couldn't count on you. Happy. I won't. You won't. But not at any cost. Hey. Don't. See you back at the pond. Oh man, they're so. It's so angsty. This is kind of a weird forced decision for Abby to make. She's upset, so she's gonna leave the group and potentially die. She's a trained soldier. She knows that that's stupid as hell, but she's angry that someone in the group is pregnant. So she runs away, and she almost gets eaten by zombies. She's, she's very, kind of weird introduction to her character. Tutorials? Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Oh, I thought I had to push forward. I looked away from my screen for a second, so I didn't see the triangle prompt. I'm so sorry, there's a jump scare right here. I think it's right here. Can I dodge it? Nope. I thought I had for a second. I'm gonna turn this shit down. It's loud. I'm just gonna run away from all these guys. I just realized this is the first instance of combat in the game, and it's like 40 minutes in. This game has a very slow start. Alright. Let's see if I can get this guy. Once he starts coming towards me. Okay. Cool. Oh, 
Um, ah, okay. Oh, we said okay at the same time. Twinsies. Jinx. Abby owes me a quarter. Uh, not a, a soda. Is it a quarter or a soda? It's a soda. Do I even need my light? Maybe. I have beaten this game like eight times. At most, I've, or at least eight times. Probably more. So I'm quite familiar with the ins and outs. I probably have like 200 hours in this game, probably more. Okay. So yeah, I'm quite cracked at it. The gunshots are so loud. I want to just have it be quiet, but you can't. It's fine. It's the morning. I'm worried that people are going to come in my room and be like, Shut the fuck up, Owen! It'll be fine, I'll just stealth it. I'm so cracked at this game, dude. And now we're with my favorite girlfriends. I love them. Ellie and Dina, they're the best. All right. Are they gonna talk or am I just wasting time not talking? Come on, talk. Come on, this way. Okay, cool. You miss being with him? With Jesse? <laughs> no. We've been together for so long. Look, Jesse's great. I love his parents. They will always be family, but we were just on autopilot. Hey, how come we never talked about this stuff? No, it didn't feel. You never really talked to me about cats. Yeah, because there isn't much to talk about. Wow. I just. I, I I'm so curious about who Cat is. About you know, we we hear about her in this conversation, okay. and she's no, in I a journal she's entry in a flashback. I've grown to like um, her or she's mentioned in a journal entry in a flashback, so but we never you? see her. And I hope and I that she right could here. make at least a cameo in season Shut two up. of the show. I think that could hey. be really cool. You can tie Shimmer up here. I wonder how they're gonna do season two. My hopes is that they would alternate back and forth between Ellie and Abby's perspective. I feel like that would make for much better pacing <laughs> to adapt it to a TV format. I get why the game did the, the, did it the other way where you switch and play as Abby for like 10 hours. I get why they did it. It's because 
you're supposed to play mm-hmm. through all of Ellie's story on her side, and then you're here, you're seeing Abby's side, mm-hmm. and the goal for them was um, like, oh, but you're then you're supposed to start caring about Abby, and then you're conflicted once you're fighting Ellie as Abby. What was um, whether or not they achieved that goal is to personal preference. It personally worked on me. Um, but, uh, I know damn well it did not work for everyone. Who used to do this route with? Jesse? Eugene. Right. Oh, Eugene. Man, he was funny. Oh, yeah. Plus, he taught me about rewiring electronics and stuff. No way! Since I was climbing in the snow, now my hands are covered in snow? That's crazy talk! Is the snow gonna melt later? I'm gonna pay mm-hmm. attention to my body and see if the snow melts later. Oh my gosh, is it melting as we speak? Wait. I feel like there was a lot more snow a second ago. We'll see, once I get up here where there's no snow to be seen, we'll see. Is the gas mask bong in here? No, it's just a regular bong. Yeah, the um. Do you have any on you, actually? Oh, I wish. Eugene always had some on him. All right. thinking of where I'm going to be in 13 minutes when I have to end the episode. Usually I'm able to end it at a good spot. I'm lucky like that. Ooh, they haven't patrolled in a month. Okay. Or I guess I just looked at it and it looks like they do it monthly. Wait. Is there any mention of cat on here? Who's Astrid? Whoa, and then Dina and Eugene do it for a while. This is such an interesting thing, because it's on... Because it's so missable, but if you read it, it's so interesting just to read, like, who was there. Sound up ahead's our last stop. Take a look. Here's the town. With the big tower thing? Yep, that's where the next lookout is. Let's get back to the horses. Question. Were you wearing the same clothes yesterday? Wait, are my, are this, is the snow gone? Oh, the snow is gone! Wait, I'm gonna pay attention next time I, I'm gonna crawl in the snow, the snow again. Wait, how's my hand? There's no snow on it, let's see now. There's snow on my hands! No f- way! That's so cool! Okay. Oh my gosh, and the horse can get covered in snow too? That's crazy! Look who's talking. 
That's crazy. I have hypothermia from wearing cans and sneakers in the snow. I am wearing boots today. You know how you're gonna die? You let me guess. You're gonna kill me? No. Maybe. Fuck you. Honestly, they are such couple to goals. They're couple goals. Or not so much near the end, but they're cute at the start for most of the game. Um. What do you know about this place? another evacuated neighborhood. Infected almost never make it out this far. We usually catch them on the outer perimeter. What are you doing tonight? Uh, I was thinking I was inviting Joel to watch a movie. Oh. Ooh, I want to read this. Dear Santa, hmm. aww. That's sad. I don't want to read it. I remember what it is. It's like, I'm pretty sure it's like, Dear Santa, can you get my... What is it? It's like, can you get my dad a gun to help protect me from zombies? It says something like that. Oh, a big dog. Okay. What's it say on the other side? Yeah, it does. Um, yeah, how did I remember that? I I only read the notes on my first playthrough. And then I just kind of like just went through it without reading anything. What about you? What are you doing later? Some people were talking about something else. When they say sneaking out, how far are they sneaking out? Because I'm hoping that they're not, like, leaving Jackson. I'll get through these, um, or at least this first part of the infected, um, and I'll end it. Ugh. Dude, Ellie and, like, the slitting throats thing is, like, it's so gross. And, like, every time I killed an enemy on my first playthrough, I was like, ah, ah, ah. It made me so uncomfortable, but I'm kind of desensitized to it now. Because I've done it probably thousands of times at this point. Okay. Boom! Got you. Get got. Noob. I want to start calling people noobs again. Like, whenever someone is like... I don't play online games, though. And that's like the only context you can really say it. Oh, am I gonna get seen? Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, get him, Dina. I feel like that's a scripted event. Like, she's, like, programmed to do that in that exact spot. Um, because she doesn't really ever 
because like the companions never really ever do that in different in later parts of the game. It's only right there that I see it consistently happen. <laughs> I am getting so much ammo. Like, what the heck? Oh, man. Oh, there's two? I thought there was only one left. Okay. That was a waste of ammo. I don't know why I did that. I'm gonna scavenge for material. You know, I'm just gonna go back to... Midnight Noise, because it makes... It makes the gunshots quieter. And he has subtitles anyways. But it makes... Yeah, it makes the dialogue sound bad. on. Ellie, help me up there. I want to look around. Okay, cool. All right, go ahead. So I think once I get to the, um, once I am given the opportunity uh, to make a first aid kit, there's a hole in the I will do there. that. I will end the episode, I mean. Here. Sorry. Wait, do they make you make a Molotov cocktail, or do they make you make a healing kit? Nice. They make you make a Look. healing kit. See? And then later, mm -hmm. Dina gives you a yeah, Molotov. Under here. Jump scare right here. The infected does truly come from absolutely nowhere. <laughs> Ellie, are you clean? Yeah. Just bang up. Please die of old age and not because you've been infected. I really don't want to have to shoot you. Yo. Okay. What's this say? Actually, yeah. Oh, is this where... Yeah, he... Okay. All of the notes are just so depressing to read, so I'm just not gonna... I mean, I'll be able to, because I know it's not real, but it's still sad. Did I already go in here? I did. Get out! Okay. See anyone that roof? I'm not sure. This way. Yep, this is I'm where in. I get the, um... Hey, got some alcohol. A couple of rags. Here, fix yourself up. It's so cool that the bandage stays on. How long does the bandage stay on? I've, I've always wondered that, but I've never paid attention That's enough to see when it despawns. Because it must despawn eventually. Okay, perfect timing. We'll pause here. And regroup later. And I just heard my Bluetooth headphones turn off. Okay, cool. Keep your eyes peeled for older infected. 